function g of x has the property that for each time the x values triple, the g of x values increase by 1. Hmm. Now, before I even look at graphs, I want to remind you of a little guy. Every time the x values triple, the y values go up by 1. So like an example of this could be like 1, 2, 3, 4. That's the x values going up by 1. This would be like 1, 3, 9, 27. Now, what we have here is we have our x values going up. And by going up, we multiply the same number every single time to move our way upward as this guy moves up by 1. This, my dear boys and girls and others, is logarithmic. When the x values explode while the y values just add the same number to move up every single time, you are dealing with a logarithmic function. With everything being positive and happy and stuff like that, which it appears to be, logarithmic functions look like this, okay? Which means you're not logarithmic. I mean, maybe you're negative logarithmic, but that's not what I'm dealing with because negative logarithmic would imply things going down. And that's not what we have. Uh, this is going up. This is my values tripling. So B is going to be my answer. C is exponential growth. And D looks like it's cubic <laughs> or cupid. I'm leaving it. You can't stop me. I'm leaving it. D is cupid because I, I love cubic functions. Uh, hope this helps.